Okay, hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a chameleon craft update video. Um, basically, where I'm going to tell you guys about how to apply to chameleon craft and all that stuff. Not anything to do with the server itself, the people on it at the moment, and my videos, and whatever, but just how you can apply if you're interested and stuff like that. Um, so, what I'm going to do is split this video into two halves. Um, it'll be in the same video, obviously. Um, the first half will be me talking about. Um, how you can apply if you have applied the do's and don'ts if, if you have applied so what to do once you've applied uh, who we accept uh, requirements and then the second half of the video will be um, some questions that I got off of uh, Skype from you guys that are eager to join so first bit I want to go through is how to apply we have some new admins on the server we, re we got them um, about two weeks ago Andrew did make a video on it so the new um, Admins are Cats for Hats, Malek, and Crack the Beat. I will put their Skype names probably if <laughs> if they let me because you, I get a lot of spam for, about the server in the description. Um, I think Cats I will definitely put in because he's got two Skypes, got a public one and a private one. Um, not so sure about Malek either, but I'll put Cats in there. I'll ask the guys later as well. Um, you can apply through them from their videos, or you can apply through me on my videos or through us on Skype or on the Minecraft forum. Now, this is the bit that gets people here. It doesn't matter what you apply on, the forum, the YouTube video, or through Skype, they're, they're, they're all even. There's no advantage if you go through Skype because you can have a conversation with us, which I'm happy to do. I'm happy to have a conversation with you on Skype. I'm absolutely fine with that. Um, but they're all equal. That's that's all I'm saying because that, that is what people get. I think some, some people think that if they add us on Skype and have a conversation with us, and then say, can I join the server? It's going to be better than if you play on um, on the Minecraft forums or on a YouTube video. Once you have applied, do not spam us asking if you can join or not. The chances are, if you have applied and we haven't got back to you, you haven't got in. And it's such a hard thing to say because saying no to someone that wants to join something so simple as a, a, a Minecraft server, it, it, you know, it, it, you know, you should be able to say yes to everyone, but you, you just can't say yes to everyone just because it will get so overcrowded. We don't know who we're accepting. We have to be very careful with who we're accepting because we did go through one point of accepting ten people in a week, and we did get griefed. So um, there is that. Um, do's and don'ts. If you have applied and talked to us on Skype, do not bumlick us. And that sounds really harsh and to the point. This video is getting very negative. But do not. Um, it's nice when people comment on my video saying, oh, great video. It was really good. Um, really enjoyed that. And then I have a conversation with them. Oh, thanks. You know, how could I improve on that video? And then you go, oh, blah, 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 blah. By the way, can I join the server? Because it just feels like we're being used almost, you know? We, you know, our video, we aren't getting complimented, which makes us feel like our videos aren't very good, for example. Um... We don't accept people, usually, if they apply to other servers. Because I can go on someone's channel and see that if you're in, a, in, a, in another server, or I've been on five other servers, or I can go on your Minecraft forum account and see who what forms you've posted on. If you've applied to ten other servers, then we're probably not going to accept you, because it's like... It's, it's almost as if, like... We, we just we just feel like you know we're just like the only other servers you know it's just like that. I'm not saying we're the top server in the world but we're not obviously but you know, it just feels like um, you know we're just you know one of the servers someone just wants to join for the hell of it and it does look more like a griefer if you do that because you just want to get on a server and grief everyone now this is something that is asked a lot um, this is about requirements now we do not have requirements such as sub counts and views on the server because this server is a YouTube server that is very important the server is not just for Minecrafters to come on and play Minecraft whenever you like we did make it for YouTubers I mean a lot of us don't make videos at the moment um, because that is college and stuff but we obviously you know we know that but if you come on the server and you make one video saying hi I've joined a server and then don't make a video ever again that is not that's not good. <laughs> you know, we don't want that. We made the video, we made the server because we wanted people to grow their channels and get a big community and, you know, get a channel and up content on their channel, you know, things like that. We have no requirements. However, 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 a an audience is good. 
we say about an audience of if you can get 50 plus views on a video that's that's a decent audience we don't say oh you've you know you're not getting this amount of views on a video but if you get a audience like a select amount so I suppose there is a kind of a requirement in the in the views department slightly with having an audience people that actually watch your videos people that actually comment you know you have an active audience not just you know you get the occasional view and stuff like that you know things like that um, one thing we do like is to have a nice clean channel when I say clean I don't mean like uh, swear free I mean a clean channel where everything looks nice so for example Andrew's channel all his thumbnails and his banner everything you know is themed cats is very much like that as well so is Mulax so is cracks so it's a lot of other people on the server a lot of their um, thumbnails and you know the descriptions everything is very clean organized if you just have videos where the titles are just like you know Chameleon craft one trees you know and it's just like random capital letters everywhere it, it, you know it doesn't really match up you need to have also it really helps this isn't a requirement either but it helps if you have a lot of videos on your channel if you've just got one video test you know you've just recorded something and you you've just filmed yourself running around the microphone that's not good because we want to see you know what you're like kind of thing we want to see who you are um, you know how you know all your videos put together so we don't care if you've got a survival game series we're gonna watch that we're gonna see what you like you know we want to see who you are and what you're like basically this is turning more into like a job interview now isn't it anyway I'm pretty sure that is it oh one more thing as well apply because you want to join a community and grow your YouTube channel and make collaborations with other people and basically make friends on YouTube and on Minecraft and on Skype don't join because you want to leech. I'm using the word leech off other people's channels. Don't join because you know someone on the server has a thousand subs and you'll be in their videos and you'll instantly get a thousand subs. Don't do that because that's it's not what we're doing. We're trying to build a community. Anyway, I need a drink. Here we go. Thank God. Me talking non-stop. Anyway. This is part two of the video where we're going to do some Q&A. So, I've got four questions of some people on Skype. Um, they're actually quite um, quite good questions. Uh, question one is from DJ underscore Illusions. He asks, is there a certain recording time or is it when we want to or able to? We don't say you can record between these times. You just come on the server whenever you want and record whenever you want. We don't say you have to record two hours of footage a week, you know. If it helps if you do videos often, but obviously, if you have an excuse like at the moment, like in the summer holidays, yeah, we would have said you know you need at least a video out a week. Um, but you know, at the moment, everyone's in college and school and wherever, and they're quite busy, so you know it's it's fine. We don't really mind people not doing as many videos at the moment. So there is no uh, recording time. Uh, question two is by uh, Evan, also known as Flushe, I believe. I probably didn't say that right. He says. Hey, maybe um, a question about the amount of subs you have or views. Um, I'm not sure sure about that. That's a quote from Skype. But like, like I said earlier, you need a good audience, I suppose. Subs don't matter. Audience is good. If you have an audience and people... Because we want Comedian Craft to be known, basically. Uh, question three. Uh, how many people will be accepted to join the server? That is from I Evil Bean. Um, how many people... We don't have a limit. But we try and keep under... Um, I don't know. We like it when we have, because it's a 12 slot server, we can increase the amount of slots we have on the server, but it's to do with the amount of RAM we're allocated. So I'm not sure how much RAM we're allocated, but 12 slots on the server is the recommended amount of people we're allowed on the server um, for the amount of RAM we have. So for example, we could upgrade, we could literally just open the slots to 100 um, and then let 100 people on, but it'll probably be really laggy. So we don't really have a um, a limit on the amount of people but we do try and like contain it at a certain amount and we don't we, we, we try to contain it when we have like 10 people on the server at once which which hasn't happened so at the moment we've just got you know, infinite. but when we get like 10 people on the server at once that is when we start to maintain it I'd say and the last question is from Chris the Kid MC who asks will the server be nice and fed to all the server as far as we know we haven't had any complaints we've had a few things with people leaving but the server is fair to everyone we don't say um you're a new member you're you know you're not allowed to go nether and stuff like you know everyone's allowed to do the same thing however there is a thing where if you do join the server we do kind of like 
we go into game mode 3 and spectate you for a bit like if you first come on the server see what you're doing every time we come on we might do it we might not so you're kind of like under almost like a review period uh, for a set amount of time uh, so that I suppose that's pretty much it actually I've spoken for about 10 minutes straight now and my voice is hurting quite a bit so uh, if you do have any questions please uh, ask them in the comments down below um, I will reply to everyone unless they are repeated I suppose or if they're things like you know kind of trying to serve because you know I've really made up anyway, thank you very much for watching that I hope you enjoyed the footage in the background I have no idea what I put in the background at all um, but I hope you enjoyed it thank you very much for watching if you did enjoy leave a like share this video around to anyone else that wants to join Chameleon Craft so they are updated and they know what to do and I will see you in another video.